I'm Christy White, your Director of Communications with the San Marcos Minute for the week of August 22nd. Some very sad news to start off with this morning. Saturday night, a 18-year-old was shot at the Townwood Apartments. Now, police tell us that his friends dropped him off to meet another friend. Um, when they were driving away, they heard gunshots. They went back to the place where they dropped him off and found him in, in, in a breezeway shot in the head. Now, that young man is recovering in an Austin hospital. We'll continue to follow the story as the investigation unfolds. There's more information about it on our website at sanmarcostx.gov on the home page. Now, I also want to remind everyone that we are still taking public comment for the Disaster Recovery Action Plan. If you haven't already taken a look at that plan and provided comment, you still have time to do so. Well, it'll, public comment will be open for a couple of weeks. You can do that by visiting the City Hall or also visiting the library where there's a hard copy, or you can go to our website at smtxbloodrecovery.com. You can view it there and also leave your comments electronically. And coming up next week on Tuesday, August 30th, we will be having a parking management public meeting. So if you're interested in parking in San Marcos and the future of parking, please attend this meeting. It's going to be at the LBJ Museum. There's more information about this on our website as well. And then we have been talking about the Compliance Alliance for the last six or so weeks. And this is our effort to get our residents to um, participate in fixing common code violations around their home. Now on Friday we had an event with Lowe's at their Build and Grow event and we um, talked a little bit about the Compliance Alliance. Our code enforcement officer was there and also we gave away a, um, a prize for people who entered our Compliance Alliance contest and so we had a great time. We hope that you'll continue to join us in fixing code violations even though the Compliance Alliance campaign is over. Now you can find more information about that on our website at sanmarcostx.gov slash compliance. And it's back to school and the kids are going back and you probably saw them all gathered at the bus stop this morning. Now we want to remind everyone to please be careful out there. Don't forget that there are school zones and we want to make sure that our kids get to school safely. And also on our Facebook page, we are collecting photos from back to school. So if your kid snapped a picture before school this morning, please be sure to share that with us on our Facebook page or email us at communications at sanmarcostx.gov. And we're celebrating this week, it's a good time, you know, after back to school, with Party in Your Park. That's going to be held on Friday starting at 6 o'clock p.m. at Dunbar. So if you are interested in participating, please come on out. There's going to be lots of games, and this is an ideal Friday afternoon for the kids, so please be sure to join us for that. And also on Friday, we'll be having a Western Dance for Adults with Disabilities. That kicks off at 7 p.m. There's more information about that on the park section of our website. And you can also find our new activity guide for fall and winter there. And you can see all of the fun events that we have planned for everyone from kids and babies all the way to our senior citizens. So please be sure to check that out. And then finally, I want to share with you that we will be off the air. Our cable channel is being upgraded, and so we are going to be off the air starting on August 24th through September 5th. Now, you won't miss any city council meetings or planning and zoning commission meetings being aired. So uh, we, we did our best to avoid that, so that shouldn't be happening, but we will not have content on the channel. So please don't forget that uh, once we get back on air, we'll have better content. So please be sure to watch our, our cable channel. And until then, you can always find fresh content on our YouTube channel and our Facebook page. We put out videos all the time. So please be sure to connect with us. Again, we're on Facebook and Twitter and also on Instagram and YouTube. Until next time, I hope everyone has a great week.